Is your cleansing routine keeping your skin flawless? Watch till the end to find out if you're doing it correctly. Hello, hello, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I am Fanny. My channel is about skincare, hair care, and beauty tips. If this is something that interests you, you are in the right place. Join the family by clicking the subscription box below, and I promise you, you're not going to be disappointed so that you can keep up to date to my tips and guides to a more beautiful you. Well, let's go straight to how to cleanse your face correctly. So first of all, you want to take a cleanser of your choice. For this demonstration, I'm going to use simple micellar water gel, which is a very good cleanser. Then you want to clean your hands. Cleaning your hands helps to avoid transfer of bacteria from your hands to your face. Then you're going to wet your face. Then depending on how your skin is, you can use a cotton pad or you can use a cloth or you can use your hands hands to clean your face and also you want to make sure you're using a lukewarm water so i'm just using a bowl of water just for demonstration but otherwise you can always use your bathroom sink then you're going to take the cleanser and massage it into your skin And also you want to make sure you are very gentle to your skin otherwise if you are being so rough you're going to damage your skin and also you want to massage this uh, cleanser or you want to clean your face for 60 seconds for a great result. For you to achieve the flawless skin, you want to use the cleanser of your skin type. So let's say your skin is oily. You want to use a cleanser which is for oily skin types. So how do you know a cleanser is for oily skin type? You want to read each and every cleanser always indicate the type of skin they are for. So if you have oily skin, it is indicated on the cleanser. You can read on the cleanser. If you have dry skin, it will also indicate and also you want to read instructions on how to use the, the cleanser it's always written on the back of the cleanser sometimes they always say you massage it into wet skin please follow the instructions for you to get to, for you to get it right then you want to rinse off the cleanser then you want to patch dry your skin just remember to be gentle on your skin always. This is how my skin looks like and feels like after a cleansing. So it is well hydrated and the cleanser I used did not strip out the oil out of my face. Then for you to complete this process, you want to go ahead and apply cream of your choice. So I'm just going to start by applying the Hydro Boost, Neutrogena Hydro Boost. Then you can use any serum of your choice depending on your skin type. Then for my under eye, I'm just going in with the CeraVe uh, eye cream. You can use any eye cream of your choice. This is actually helps to avoid puffiness under your eyes. Thank you. 
then you can go ahead and apply cream of your choice and for this demonstration I'm using Eucerin cream and I'm going to apply a generous amount of it for my skin Then you can go ahead and uh, apply sunscreen of your choice. Always remember to apply sunscreen as it also helps these products to work more effectively. And also sunscreen help our skin and also protect our skins from UV rays. Well, skincare is not done without you applying some lip gloss or lips, uh, lip balm in your lips. So I'm just going in with honey bars to, and I'm applying them on my lips. Then this is how my skin came out looking like. It is well moisturized, very hydrated. Let me know. Go and try this process and let me know how your skin came out in the comment section below. So this is the end of this video. I hope you have enjoyed. Please subscribe by clicking on the subscription box below and you join the family. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time. Bye bye.